Nearly 200 commercial vehicles have been turned around just this week trying to enter Great Smoky Mountains National Park, and the Park Service says that it's just not safe for those vehicles to enter through the windy mountain roads. National Park Rangers staff all the entrances to the National Park, ready to keep oversized trucks from going up the windy and steep Newfound Gap Road. I know it's busy out here and notice before right in here there was uh, about four tractor trailers and they're having a hard time figuring it out themselves. <laughs> the Park Service said they turned away 80 vehicles on Tuesday. On Monday it was 92 with thousands of other cars making this their new route. You know the park is busy. I'm kind of used to that. It's not I didn't notice it exceptional, but it's busy. Chug Prime has already been stuck behind a truck that just couldn't make the turn around the switchback. Stuck behind two semis and I had to just go back and wait. And then one other time we're wandering around and some truck was in a really bad spot. I don't know how he got out. TDOT says its crews also responded on roads outside the park saying they're trying to open closures back up as soon as they can because of the problems drivers face. Tractor trailer driver, they don't actually uh, probably know the road. They don't know where they're going. They're following their probably hopefully their GPS and they're probably not too happy when they get to those winding roads. Of course, TDOT reminding all commercial vehicles to make sure that you are staying on those designated routes. That really is the safest way to navigate around the areas of the flood zone. Reporting in Great Smoky Mountains National Park, Kyle Granger, WVLT News. <clears throat>